Hi, it's Amanda. Welcome to my channel. It is wash day and I have mentioned already that I no longer use the curl piece or the African Pride Moisture Miracle detanglers because of the pegs and the fact that I don't use pegs in my products anymore. I have also run out of my melanin hair care multi-use leave-in conditioner. I have been using the Kids Neapolitan Collection uh, chocolate or maybe it's banana, whatever, the, the conditioner from that line and also the leave-in, along with my Bo Peep Naturals Manifest Oil. I've just picked up another multi-use detangling conditioner. So I'm going to be trying that out for today's wash day as my pre-poo. This is the Renewed Queen Essentials Slip Like Silk Multi-Use Conditioner. It can be used as a co-wash, a leave-in, and a detangler. I will start reviewing Renewed Queen Essentials in my B.O.B. 123 series in the next two weeks or so. But if you are interested in the products or you've already used them before, I do have a discount code. You can use AMANDA10 at checkout for 10% off. The main ingredient in here for the detangling is the aloe. I'm gonna take this style out it is done. My edges are frizzy. My hair is frizzy because I don't apply gels really. I don't apply edge control. I let my hair do what it wants to do. I don't really care. But these beads have held in. Let me do a 360 for you. Um, my hair, by the way, feels amazing. I'm going to be using the mango butter again to seal my ends and possibly going to use it on the rest of my hair today. I used the Renewed Queen Essentials Twist and Curl Buttercream earlier this week for this style. And I would just say my hair feels like moisture-wise it could go like another week. It actually feels fantastic. Okay, the hair is out. It, <laughs> when I say my hair is still really moisturized, my hair is really moisturized. I am on day seven and... It just feels so well hydrated and it doesn't feel dirty or anything. My scalp is not itching. I could probably go another few days, but I mean, it's wash day. This is when I wash my hair. Renewed Queen Essentials Slip Like Silk Multi-Use Conditioner. Oh, wow. I love this. It's kind of like a baby powder, slightly floral scent. This is what it looks like. So it's not very, very thick, but none of the pre-poos I've used have been very, very thick. Yeah. <laughs> okay. At first praying hands. Yes, my hair is very moisturized right now, but I just felt something a little bit extra. I like this. It does feel a little bit different having put this on. This is very hydrating. See about the slip. Okay, it has it. My pre-poo routine these days is pretty quick. I put on in one of my quadrants instead of doing like, you know, this piece and then doing this piece and then doing the other. I think I can get away with that now because my hair is longer. And then I just twist it to maintain the detangling. I like to concentrate everything on my ends these days. By the way, the mango butter was fantastic. If you haven't seen my second Taibe Naturals review, I used mango butter for the first time on my ends as I was styling, and it did a fantastic job of actually hydrating my ends throughout the week, which I did not think was possible. Okay, this feels really good and it smells really good. I'm going to apply my Opeep Manifest Oil to seal all of that in. It has good slip. It smells really good, which is just nice. A little aromatherapy, never hurt anyone. And it's very hydrating. I did not apply water like I normally do before applying products. But as I said, that, that's why I said hydrating versus moisturizing. This didn't need me to add water underneath. So that was pretty cool. So I'm going to wrap this up, go do the other sides, and then I'll come back when I'm done and let you know if I have any final thoughts. I might not, but I can just let you know that I finished. It's nice to end a video looking nice, but this is the situation. So I think it's a good detangler. I would definitely recommend it as a co-wash and a detangler. I wouldn't as quickly recommend it as a leave-in only because it has incetrimonium chloride as the third ingredient. And it's more recommended to use that ingredient as a rinse out rather than something that you leave in your hair. But outside of that, I think it did a fantastic job. It smells really great, had a good amount of slip, and I'll be using this product for the time being. So I am gonna go and pre-poo and pump, and I will be back on Tuesday with my next wash day review. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like my content and haven't done so already, please consider subscribing. Like, comment, and share, and I'll talk to you in my next one. Thanks, and have a good one.